Aurora's Nature Notes, where we invite you to discover Aurora's true nature. Today we're visiting the 200-acre Star K Ranch Open Space Park, where we're going to take a closer look at cottonwood trees. It's hard to miss a mature cottonwood tree. As Aurora's largest native tree, their deeply furrowed bark and large harp-shaped leaves are the signature of habitats graced by water. Their namesake comes from the cotton female trees produce which is designed to help spread tiny seeds across the landscape. What is easy to miss is the life cottonwoods breathe into our local air. Powered by energy from the sun and water, cottonwood trees quietly bank carbon dioxide, turning it into cottonwood tree parts, which provide shade, food, and shelter for many. Sometimes signs of life can be scribbled in the cottonwood tree. This little sign of life right here is from a young beetle. Hatched out of an egg as a larva and began chewing its way through the beginning of its life. As it got larger and larger, you can see that the scribble mark gets wider and wider. And then the beetle spends the winter as a pupa, and the next year it hatches out and flies away. One great way to look for life in a cottonwood tree is to look for holes. This large hole, excavated by a northern flicker, is a great place for a woodpecker to raise a family. Looking further down the tree, you'll see that there are even smaller holes holes that indicate insects like beetles, wasps, and bees might also be raising a family in this cottonwood tree. Even dead cottonwood trees are full of life. Standing dead trees, called snags, are nature's condominiums, high density housing for animals of all kinds. If you want to discover Aurora's true nature, we suggest you spend some time with a local cottonwood tree. Its ability to breathe life, support life, and create life even in its death will amaze you. To learn more about cottonwood trees or Aurora's nature, visit auroragov.org forward slash nature.